the science guy. Hey guys, Bill Nye here to talk about the planets. As you can see, I'm on the moon, and behind me is the Earth. Since I'm on the moon, my mass is one-sixth the mass it would be if I was on Earth. One key role in the planet is gravity. Gravity is the magical glue that keeps the planets in orbit. Gravity is the same force that pulls this block to the ground. As you already know, there are nine planets in our solar system. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto. This is the giant Lego sun of science. Now you can see this giant block represents the sun. This block over here represents Mercury. This model shows how far Mercury would be and how big it would be if the sun was this big. If you would, please consider the following. This is a giant poster of science. This shows all the planets and its length from the sun. Let's start with the first planet in our solar system, Mercury. Mercury has no moons or no atmosphere. It is about 46 million kilometers from the sun. Next is Venus. It's the sister planet of the Earth and about 108 million kilometers away from the Sun. Now we're at our home planet Earth. Earth is the only planet with life and is 150 million kilometers away from the Sun. Now we are at the red planet Mars. It's red because of the iron in the soil. It's about 245 million kilometers from the Sun. Next is Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system and 741 million kilometers away from the Sun. The next planet is Saturn. It has icy rings that are made of broken rocks and is about 1 million kilometers away from the Sun. Uranus is sometimes considered the sister planet of Neptune. Scientists just discovered that Uranus has rings. It is 2 billion kilometers away from the Sun. And last but not least is Neptune. Like Jupiter, Neptune also has a storm you can see, but it's not as intense as Jupiter's storm. And this is the part we're all waiting for. Poor Pluto. Pluto was a, named a dwarf planet in 2006 and is 5.9 million kilometers away from the Sun. Well, thank you for joining me on considering the following. Well, that's her show. If you excuse me, I have some moon rocks to observe. See you next time.